And now the finale. The one behind this? Mr. Murloc! You're the culprit! Uh, will you shut up? I have to say, I'm incredibly disappointed in you, Mayor Myers. You know you're playing right into Pokemon's hands, don't you? Rhyme City's a lost cause if you can't even protect your only daughter. What did you say? Go. Murloc! You were deceiving me? Your role in this has come to an end, Mayor. As for the great detective duo, I knew you were good, but even I'm impressed you made it all the way here. Mr. Murloc! Those cubes will never be used again. Give up already. <laughs> <laughs> you really think I care about that plan? It was nothing more than a means to an end. Behold! This is the masterpiece that I've truly been creating. You mean, this has nothing to do with the cubes? We saw the meteorite and the aurora drop in the lab. Do those have something to do with my dad and Pikachu? Excuse me? You dared to snoop through my research? <laughs> Common rabble like you wouldn't understand it anyway. Explaining it would be pointless. Just pay attention. Pay attention? I've got a bad feeling about this. Pangoro? Oh, they got you guys. You're all they're right. not all right. No, no, they're they're all not all right. The cubes are there. Here they are. No, huh? no, no. Look at you. Huh? No. <laughs> what do you think you're doing? But why, Pangoro? You see the cubes now. Please tell me you see the cubes. Look. Of course, they're all being controlled. No, no, Merla, let me out. Hey. Okay, it seems I've got everything I need. It's time to get the show started! <laughs> You're wondering why I've done all this? I'm about to realize my dream. My dream of becoming a Pokemon. Bill beat you to it, man! Bill has beaten you to it! Why are you claiming this? Sir? Sir, you make me angry. You want to become a Pokemon? Yes. Yes, I do. And to achieve this, I needed... <laughs> and to achieve that, I needed this. I believe you may recognize Yeah, that's the this. Aurora Drop. The Aurora Drop? What are you... What are you gonna do with that? Easy. <laughs> Oh. 
It worked. A Pokemon? Wait, hold on a minute. What Professor Gordon said about the Pokemon from space? <laughs> <laughs> Deoxys has returned! <laughs> this can't be happening. And to think I was complicit in this madman's plan. Oh, the best is yet to come. You haven't even transformed into him. <gasps> it's killing Pikachu! Pikachu! Murloc! Let him go! Oh, I've come too far to stop now. The sleeping man and Detective Pikachu both brought me the energy I need. These two energies come together as one. All of my research, all of my dreams, will finally become reality! for humans to understand Pokemon is for them to become Pokemon themselves. A union of human and Pokemon. This is the true meaning of coexistence! Oops. <clears throat> he smashed his own toy. Your friend Pikachu? Well, what are you waiting for? As you can see, weaklings like you aren't even worth my time. That's not very nice. building we probably might want to get out of here too but we have to figure out how to reverse uh what now we've got to do something yeah we do but first i need to help pikachu <clears throat> what's that uh the ceiling is caving in <gasps> what'd you forget now <laughs> What's happening? It's Mewtwo! Mewtwo's battling him, I guess. Mewtwo!
I cannot imagine why, but I sense a human's presence within that Pokémon. Tell me, what has happened? He fused. That guy used the energy in that and Pikachu to become... Deoxys! Is that so? Not only has he misused my energy, he is using a Pokémon for his... Oof. Uh... You two? Well, this is a battle of the ages. You really ought to be careful who you're fighting, Burlock. You don't know what you're getting into. something. This lab's gonna collapse before either one of them wins. We need to get somewhere safe. That's it! Rachel, Mr. Myers, take shelter in the elevator. But, Tim... I'll save Pikachu. Okay, Growlithe and the others might be hurt. I'll take care of them. Come on, Papa, let's go! Right. Tim, you be careful. I will. <laughs> Growlithe and the others will be safe with Rachel. I gotta focus on saving Pikachu. I'm coming, Pikachu! Alright, we gotta figure out what this thing is. Can we observe his body? Murloc's body. He looks like he's just sleeping, but he's actually been fused with the Pokemon like Dad. Uh, no other comments. Okay. Gotta figure out how to rescue Pikachu. Pikachu's inside the pod, but I can't get it open. Can you hear me, Pikachu? Yes, I can hear you. You don't have to <laughs> shout. Oh, I'm so glad you're okay. Yeah, more or less, but this thing won't open up. Can you get me out of here? It won't open from this side either. Must be locked. You don't see a passcode terminal but here by chance, do you? I'll take a look. Thanks, Tim. Alright, uh, well. I mean, there's this. Pretty sure the pod will open if I input a passcode here. We saw two numbers written down in Murloc's lab. Yep, those are the numbers. I've written those down. One of those ought to open this. Uh, I'm going to try the other password. Six zero eight. There we go. Pikachu. Uh, oh, wow, that was intense. <laughs> but looks like both me and Pikachu are okay. <sighs> what a relief. I gotta say, looks like the party's in full swing. Believe it or not, it's Murloc. Yeah, I know. Looks like he's become a Pokémon. We have to stop him somehow. I can't imagine you two losing. But we humans caused this mess. We're the ones who've got to clean it up. Yeah. What about your body? I look safe enough in there. Anyway. Let's hurry. You okay? Maybe we should have caught him? Yeah. This is bad. Oof, I'm feeling kind of wobbly. Must be all the energy he drained out of me. Oh no, what about the original Pikachu's consciousness? Hey, don't look so down. Everything will be fine once we take care of things here. Besides, we got Mewtwo right over there. Yeah. So all we gotta do is stop Murloc. But how? Your guess is as good as mine. All we know is got to do whatever we can. Right. Great detective tip number 48. Never ever give up. That's the spirit, Tim. First, let's stop this machine. Alright. Uh, best way to do that is probably figure out uh, how to unplug it or something. Because the, the note said to unplug. Murloc used this machine to fuse with the, himself Deoxys. 
we could find stop the energy Murloc extracted from being supplied to the machine, we might be able to reverse the fusion. Okay, so how do we do that? What are you asking me for? I got no clue how to stop this thing. But in this situation, I think the simplest thing to do is cut the power. Come on, Tim. Alright, the easiest way to cut the power is to... Uh, we could look at the body, actually. There it is! Dad's body! Murloc just used it to extract the energy he needed. Hold on, Dad. When this is all over, I'll save you, I swear. Uh... What? This is all... Save. He just fused. Nothing. What about this? This must be the power supply for the fusion machine. How can we stop this thing? Sorry, Tim. This is beyond me. I thought you knew a lot about electricity. Electricity is one thing. Why would I want anything to... Why would I know anything about a specialized piece of equipment like this? Let's just fiddle around with it and see what works. Not like we could do anything else. Maybe we'll learn something useful if you start pressing random buttons. As long as it doesn't explode or something if I press the wrong one. I'm pretty sure that won't happen. It doesn't make sense to break a machine with this important with explosives. Ha! <laughs> we underestimate him, though. There's no time. We just gotta go for it. While you push some buttons, Tim, try to deduce how to cut off the power to the machine. Uh, here's a switch. No good. That didn't cut off the power. There's probably a specific order you gotta do this in. Uh, oh, you don't say. Uh, One, two, three, four, and then push the switch. Oh. Oh, it's so close, wasn't I? I think what's most important is tackling it in the right order before you... Okay, so maybe it's one, two... Three, four, because like I uh I got three of the four right, and then it hesitated, so it has to be this order. Oh, really? Never mind then. Uh, let's see. How about? Okay, so this is one blue, two blues, three blues, four blues. Maybe it's Order of the Blues? Oh, it is in the Order of the Blues! Perfect. It has a logic to it. Alright, the switches are off. Looks like that shut down the power supply. Good job, Tim. I'm not so sure. Cutting the power doesn't seem to be reversing the fusion at all. Darn, back to the drawing board. I think I gotta fiddle with the fusion machine itself. It's not like I got any other ideas. Come on, Pikachu! Alright, well, I kind of like how the background has uh, Deoxys and <laughs> Mewtwo fighting each other. This is the fusion machine. It looks even more complicated than the power supply. Yeah, but we still gotta stop it. I think those glowing bits are for the energy. Or the energy used maybe if we remove the capsules. But how do we remove the capsules? I know I saw something in Murloc's lab about emergency procedures. God, this is the worst possible time to forget. I know it's not appropriate. It's not an approach a detective should take, but I think trial error is our only option now. I'll see what I can do. Uh, well, there's this. You could read it, but let's examine. It didn't work. I pushed the button. Uh, there's another way. Blue? If I push it, huh? I, hold on. We got it in the wrong order. Try messing with something else. If I push this button, huh? The capsule's still locked in. Oh, that's what it is. Well, unplug it first. Do you think we should pull this cable out? Yep. And then... Yeah, we disconnected it. But the machine's still running. There's gotta be an order. Try poking around some more. Now press the button. Nice guess. I think it would release the lock. Now push the other one. How about this button? Thank you god, it looks like it released the lock. Alright, now what? Uh, do we just take them? Yeah, we got 
we got blue energy. Now we got orange energy. It's, uh, it's the energy of the portals. We managed to remove both energy capsules from the machine. Let's see if that did anything to Murloc. It didn't work. Nothing's changing. Well, maybe removing the excess energy didn't do anything because they're already fused together. Think, Tim. There has to be another way. Wait a minute. Murloc wrote about the energy in that report of his we uncovered. That's right. What exactly did Murloc use that energy for again? To make himself... Uh... It had to be to run the machine. I thought... No? No, that's not right. Is it purely just to there make himself deoxys? Use the energy. Uh, use himself. Yeah. That's it. If Murloc used that energy to fuse himself with deoxys, then maybe that's the key to separating them. Whoa, whoa, whoa! What are you going on about? Murloc and deoxys are fused together because of that energy, according to the report. The balance of that energy is crucial. Oh, so we just gotta disrupt that balance! Yeah, but how do we do that? We gotta send some sort of... A... We could either expose it to more energy, or remove energy from Murloc's body. Can we use a cube on him? He said the cubes are toys. I don't think destroying the machine is a good idea. We did... I think if we expose it to more energy, it would make more sense. If we can somehow expose the access to these two energies... That excess energy will throw off the balance! But... Because you can't take away that? energy, but you can always add more energy. Once we figure that out, we can get back at him for throwing me into that pod. Deoxys flying around. The busted fusion machine. And then there's me, the great detective Pikachu. What are you thinking, Pikachu? Aha! I think I've got it! A bolt of brilliance! I'll jump up from the top of this machine and hit Deoxys with the energy! Oh, how very thoughtful. Is it real coffee or is that just oil? Yeah. <sighs> Time to close this case! <laughs> the random coffee... <laughs> the random coffee gets me. <laughs> if we take the elevator, I should be able to get over there. Okay, hand him over, Tim. Yeah. There. Hmm. Looks like we're ready to go. So, hit it. <laughs> Tim seems very hesitant because we don't even get the dad back, maybe. You're sure you can do this? You mean hit Deoxys in midair with two capsules of energy? You can't do that. Only I can do this. Yeah, I know. It's just, isn't there another way? Come on. Who do you think I am, Tim? In all my cases, I've never given up. I'm the great detective Harry Goodman! We've gathered all the evidence we need. Now all we gotta do is use it to pin down the culprit. Please, be careful. Just leave this to me. Uh-oh. I think they're at their peak limit there. Wait, what are they doing? If we unleash those moves, this place will explode! 
I've got to hurry. Do I have to do reaction time? Probably reaction time. Hit Deoxys with the energy. Okay, let's get this done. Just need our body to hold out for me. Oh, press smash the button, dude. He's using quick attack. Oh no, is it quick attack or is it the agility? You okay? How could such a insignificant <sighs> There goes the Aurora drop. Pikachu Uh Come on, you've gotta hurry. I can't. <laughs> I've used up all my strength. I can't make it. You need to go on without me. But, Dad... Get them to safety. Don't wait up for me. Hang in there. We're almost out of here. Uh, the fire department would probably be on their way right about now. No one just sees that amount of smoke. It just goes like, oh, what? Dad or Pikachu? Tim. What? Oh, well, there's the capsule. Uh, get out of the way. The. I'm surprised that it didn't do more damage. The pod? <laughs> Dad! Tim, hey. Sorry, I kept you waiting so Dad! long. I... And me too is over there. Easy now. You're gonna break my ribs. I'm so glad you're okay. Pikachu too. Yeah. Oh no, that's Murloc. Nice sound asleep. He really did a great job back there. Yeah, that was me, you know. <laughs> Half you, maybe. That's fair. Come on. Everyone's waiting. Let's go home. Yeah. 
Dad, can we adopt a Darmanitan? tan? Excuse me, sorry. And that was the game! Oh my goodness! We've done it! Everyone is happier again. Now that those cues aren't in place, of course. I'm sure the Friendship Week speech has changed quite a bit since we changed the mind of Mayor Myers. I kind of enjoyed this game, even though it was silly. And there are a lot of things that were kind of predictable-ish or whatnot. I'm glad, I'm glad they made this game. Anyways. Um... I don't know why he chose Deoxys, of all things. Oh, I would totally go for that pizza. Um, I don't know why he chose Deoxys, of all things, to transform into. Would you guys pick Deoxys, or what would you pick if you were to transform into a Pokemon? I still insist that Bill was the first one. He accidentally was trying to teleport and whatnot. And with that teleportation power, he uh, turned into a, what looked like a Slowpoke, but it could have been something else. I'm not sure what the anime shows for that, but, uh, yeah. If I were to turn into a Pokemon, or at least, uh, become more friends with the Pokemon, I would go with Gardevoir. That's totally my Pokemon that I would go with. It seems like Mewtwo hopefully will get some peace again. Go back to his cave, maybe we remodel it and whatnot. Hopefully he'll have some peace and quiet from everyone trying to invade it and whatnot. Warlock's probably going to be in jail, which is a good thing, because he was terrible for just wanting to fuse Pokemon, basically. Fuse into a Pokemon and, like, try to just cause destruction. I feel like if he didn't have come back and fight with Mewtwo in the lab, he would have went everywhere and just got his revenge. I also have a th feeling that Mewtwo was like, maybe Murloc as a kid found Mewtwo's cave and failed, uh, barely survived the Mewtwo battle with it or something. I feel like he would have totally had some sort of revenge plot <laughs> against Mewtwo of all people. And he's like, he's like, oh, Deoxys, that's the most powerful thing. Yeah, let's take that thing over and then kill Mewtwo with it or something. I don't know. That's why he was so gung-ho at the end, I feel. But he could have turned into Arceus or something. That would have killed Mewtwo for sure. Or Mew. Heck, hit it in the weak spot and turn into a Mew or something. Kind of awful, though, if you think about it. Like, having the... If he turned into Mew and faced off Mewtwo, who would win? Mew or Mewtwo? Uh, as far as this uh, Let's Play is gone, I even though I got sick for one part of it after... Uh, going to Japan in the middle of this Let's Play. I did have fun. I had fun with the voices, and I had fun uh, just trying to react and be chill about playing this game. It taught me a lot about planning pretty well. Wait, are you serious? Kaishi Tang was uh, Harry Goodman? I feel like that's familiar from the... Oh my gosh, you're... Oh, he's Butler? Oh, I know him. I, or I, I don't... I, I know his name. I've, I haven't met him personally, but that's... That's kind of cool. Okay. Pangoras, like... It looks like Pangoras teaching a tilt children, even though it's not necessarily his children. Kaiji Tang, I think, was a Yakuza voice actor in some part. I believe it was in Yakuza 7 that I think he was featured in. That is a game I definitely want to do at some point in the future, but I don't feel ready for it yet. It is a kind of huge RPG, so we'll get into that whenever I finish 5 and 6 as well. Um, as for different games that I want to do in the future, uh, I have seen a suggestion that did pique my interest. I'll look into that, but I still have to do other things. Um, I think my next Let's Play will involve a, sto 
uh, another story driven kind of uh, game, but it will be slightly different than normal because it'll be. Uh, I'm thinking of doing something that is more uh, reactionary gameplay rather than uh, not. Well, it, it'd be like exploring and walking around. <coughs> not much like this game. But this game was definitely fun, even though it had um, different line. It, it definitely concluded the first one's story, that is for sure. Aw, oh, that Pikachu. Everyone's excited. There's no divorce, I see. They're, they both have the rings. Do I have to press a button or do anything here? I don't think so, do I? Is there an ending cutscene? Also, there's also one other thing I'm hoping to look at. Are, is, the, is there a completionist kind of oh, thing? come on, Dad. Please, take me on a case. I think I'd make a great detective. I don't know. You get bored really fast. <laughs> What's that got to do with it? Sophia, you're still young, and detective work is dangerous. Aww. Go on, Harry. Tell her what it's like. Uh, Sophia, the thing about being a detective is... I could take your calls! Oh, maybe. Harry! Pikachu is a Pikachu. Oh, but it has a little amnesia. Oh. Oh. Okay. So what happens if you load... I'm pretty sure if you load the thing, it would load whatnot. Okay. I don't think this game has uh, the completionist side of things. That's unfortunate. Would have been nice to see if there was any... Um, Pikachu emote kind of progress. I was hoping for it the entire time and I got disappointed here. Anyways, I don't think I will go back through and try to do a Pikachu emote kind of compilation. If you guys want that, let me know in the comments below if you want that. Uh, I'll probably make it a bonus video if it's uh, on popular demand. Thank you guys for watching this Let's Play and I hope you had a great time watching it and I hope to see you in a different game that I decide to let's play. We'll see you guys then.